Hey guys, it's me, Christina Marie. I am actually going to be trying out a powder foundation today. This is by Physicians Formula. It is a mineral wear talc free loose powder. Um, this is actually, a, it says foundation coverage and natural matte finish. So let's go ahead and just open it up and see whether it looks good on the skin or not. I'm gonna do half of my face and we're gonna see if it can take away this red pigmentation that I have in my skin. Okay, you open it up and has this tiny little like kabuki brush on top. Pull that out. Wow, this is actually very, very dense, guys. This is not just like a wimpy brush. It's very packed. The bristles are packed very hard together. Go ahead and open it up. So normally when I have a loose powder, I kind of pour it into something, but I don't know. I'm going to pour it like this into the top see how much actually comes out omg that was just a few pats and you guys can see how much powder actually came out let's go ahead and try with this brush you guys can see right there and let's just dive right in wow guys i'm like so super impressed here I'm just looking at this and this honestly has such like a beautiful, it says the matte finish. I'm going to disagree with that because it almost gives like this a beautiful, I mean, it's like a semi matte, but it's like, it gives a beautiful like silk look to my skin. So what do you guys think? I think that this looks so pretty on my skin. It's like, it's natural at the same time. I have like this beautiful natural silky finish if you guys can see that i know it says it's matte and you don't see the light really reflecting too much off of it but and it doesn't look a dewy so it is a semi matte but look at how much like red pigment it covered now does it last all day i don't know we're gonna go to the movies do a bunch of stuff today and i will do some check-ins for you guys to let you guys know whether this is a good foundation or not but for a powder foundation this looks absolutely stunning on half of my skin i'm just like wow so i'm gonna go ahead and finish up my makeup i will be back and tell you guys whether this is worth it or not okay guys so i just wanted to tell you that the kabuki brush it comes with when you do this it's the bristles are so hard i guess you can say it feels like you're kind of stabbing or poking your face a little bit so i got my this is a powder brush that i typically use and then i just pushed it down i want you to see if you use a more fluffy uh powder brush how or dense fluffy powder brush if that made sense because you can see this is much bigger how much easier it is to apply you guys can see like much much easier and then it's not so abrasive to the skin especially under the eye where i was trying to get that under the eye so just sweeping this like this this coverage is absolutely fantastic okay guys so this is a check-in four and a half hours later and i went to the restroom we are at the movie theater i went to the restroom and got some one ply toilet paper and just pushed the makeup back down because i was very very oily and besides where my glasses sit on my nose as you can see it looks amazing my skin looks amazing i'm gonna check in in a few more hours and let you guys know did it hold up throughout the whole day or not okay so let me explain i totally forgot to turn on the camera before i took off my makeup so lucky for you guys you guys get a two-day test of wearing this foundation now it did last on the first video now this is the second video i'm going to see if it will last all day long i'm wearing it right now i've been wearing it for an hour already and it does look fabulous so but i'm going to check in i work on an 11 hour shift today i'm going to check in throughout the whole 11 hours okay, so it's been two hours and i already started producing oils you can see how shiny my nose is right there so i'm going to get this mcdonald's and mcdonald's uh napkin i was gonna say one ply it is one ply when you open it up like this i'm gonna push my nose and down with the paper towel and see if the foundation resets so you guys can see the oil that came off my face it's right all right here makeup went right back down Okay guys, so I've been wearing it for seven hours today. And you know what? It's raining today in Las Vegas. So there is a tad bit of humidity in the air that I'm not used to. And the makeup looks fantastic. Look, like even the only part that you can actually see that it came off was where my 
where my glasses lay right there. You know, I put on my glasses, they lay right there, they take off my makeup, and you can see the redness underneath right there. But do you see any red in the rest of my face? No. I think this is like, this is fantastic. Mind you, I have patted my face down today probably like um, three or four times with uh, the with the paper towel with the napkin and I showed you just to push it back down because I do have very very oily skin but look at this doesn't this look really really good okay so I'll check in, in a little bit and let you guys know did it last a whole day or okay, not so this is an eight hour check-in I thought I would come to the restroom you guys can see in this lighting much better than in the car my foundation looks amazing I'm honestly gonna say this is one of my new favorite um, powder foundations now there is something you need to be aware about this powder foundation is extremely like loose and I know it sounds stupid for me to say that but like it seems like it goes everywhere when you're applying it like it just like it puffs in the air if that makes sense <laughs> anyways besides the fact that it kind of gets everywhere it looks so amazing on the skin so I'm gonna give this foundation a total thumbs up if you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up and hit the little subscribe button for notifications of new videos. I'm Christina Marie. I'm out. Bye.